this weekend was was a, a, a good weekend for us. I, it, we uh, uh, it was a struggle uh, when you go against uh, a team like the College of Charleston. Uh, they've been one of the top teams in the conference certainly since uh, I've been around here the last four years. And uh, last year they were in the the championship game, uh, and we uh, we played them pretty tough last year. But uh, you know this year we felt like it was going to really be a challenge. They uh, they have their number one and number two pitcher uh, pitchers are. Uh, have been all conference uh, pitchers and uh, you know they're, they're just tough they're, and if you look at their stats just from a statistical standpoint they're a, 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 probably one of the all around best teams in the conference uh, with uh, defense uh, offense and pitching so we knew we had our um, we had our work cut out for us and uh, we really struggled in the the first game and uh, but the second game we you know we feel like uh, there were a couple things that didn't go our way and and we really felt like uh, we didn't get a win that that uh, that we certainly wanted, if not deserved. And uh, uh, so the third game became really crucial for us. And so uh, winning that game was was huge in a lot of ways. I, uh, you know, we're, we're battling out battling here in the conference for for a seating, a very important uh, position in the seating. And uh, we're we're going to be going against some. We're, we're actually battling the weather, even though we're not playing this uh, this next weekend. Our buys in the last weekend, uh, we could. There's a couple opponents that we can finish off with more wins than, and they could end up ahead of us on a winning percentage because they, they didn't had a lot of games rained out. So that win was uh, was crucial for us just from a win standpoint. From a self confidence standpoint, we're, you know we're going into the uh, tournament knowing that we've beaten some of the best teams this year. Last year we uh, um, we had some really good uh, conference uh, series uh, victories, uh, but we couldn't win one away. And this year. Uh, we've won series away, and we've uh, beaten some uh, very good teams on on their turf, and and that was that was huge. Um, as far as some, we had some individual uh, uh, performances uh, from a season standpoint that were significant. Um, Amelia Griffin uh, tied, and certainly has uh, an opportunity in uh, the uh, conference tournament to uh, break the single season uh, record for steals. Um, and then, of course, the, the big record uh, for us here at Western was broken uh, this last weekend in that last game, and, and the, the strikeouts were critical, and that was with uh, Jordan Garrett in the strikeout record. Um, and so, uh, you know, we knew that she would probably be chasing that. By the time we got halfway through the year, she was really piling up the strikeouts, and uh, she's been uh, continuing to, to get them in tough games against tough hitting teams here in conference when they, they really matter. So we were really proud of her. and. And uh, you know, she really had to step up big in that last uh, last game because once again, it felt like all weekend we were battling more than just uh, College of Charleston. There were other things that were going on that that we had to overcome, and uh, so and, and they did that. So you, you have those performances, even though you look at them from an individual milestone. Uh, we got a couple kids that uh, had started struggle at bat, and they came through and started hitting again. And uh, you know, you you that that's what you want to do going into uh, a tournament here like we have in this year you know you can just plain look at the standings it's uh, uh, you know app uh, obviously got themselves a little bit of distance uh, uh, in first place although they've got to finish it off but uh, uh, it was kind of a strange thing to be sitting where we were in seventh place and knew if we swept college Charleston at least leaving the weekend we'd have been tied for second place and that's a that's kind of a tells you where the conference is so you know I, I stand by for the for the tournament that's going to be interesting